Good morning, everyone, and thank you for starting your day off with me. I'm Jenna Stauffer. Now, I know the image you see behind me probably makes you want to jump back into bed, but please don't do that. This is just the cover to my first guest this morning's newest book. Now, he's a recently published author, but he's definitely not new to the world of writing. He's always written, whether it's been for newspapers, for magazines, or for plays. Now his name is Rodney Ross, and I think you should get familiar with that because you're going to hear it much, much more. He recently relocated to Key West just about three years ago, and he's originally from Indiana, so I love him already. What I like is that his mother's name is Diana Ross, so Rodney says that it left little to chance that he'd be supreme. Rodney, thank you for being with <laughs> thank me. Thank you so morning. much for having me this morning, Jenna. Oh, it's a pleasure having you here, and I just love that, Rodney. <laughs> Your mother was Diana Ross. Diana Ross. <laughs> she is, uh, since she got married in 1960, she has heard this for the last 52 years at airports. Every time she writes a check, people <laughs> say, "Sing me a song," uh -huh. you know. So it's it's sort of become a little routine. Like Abbott and Costello, when I travel with my mother, Diana Ross, we sort of have this little comedy routine right. that we and, do. And so do you tell people that? Like, I have Diana Ross. Oh, yes. Right. The last book setting I had here in Key West, uh, I actually advertised that you, in the bonus round is not only do you, do you get to meet me, but you get to meet Diana Ross. <laughs> so imagine people's surprise when they came in and there's a, uh, a white woman in dressy sweat smiling, <laughs> going, hi, I'm Diana Ross. <laughs> That's great. Yeah, it was. It was funny. I love it. Okay, Rodney. Now, as I mentioned, you recently just moved to Key West. Indeed. Okay, so where were you before Key West? Uh, I grew up in a small town in Indiana, outside of Indianapolis, uh, Frankfort, Indiana, population about 14,000 or so, okay. between Lafayette and Indianapolis. Mm -hmm. um, from there, I went to Butler University, mm -hmm. uh, majored in English and journalism, and then sort of segued into advertising. Once I realized I probably could make a great living telling the truth, as a journalist, <laughs> I thought, oh, I'll tell lies in advertising. <laughs> and I did that then for the, gosh, the next 30 years or so, mm -hmm. until at age mm, 47 or so, I and my partner decided to relocate down here full time. And that's when the novel muse sort of lit on my shoulder, mm -hmm. and I started writing the cool part of his pillow. Okay, so this book, the one that you just released, yes. it didn't happen until you came here to Key West. Not really. I had the idea, but I really didn't have the time because I was working in advertising. Mm -hmm. And the last thing you want to do after eight hours of writing all day, commercials, flyers, uh, uh, infomercials, the last thing you want to do when you get home is write some more mm -hmm. for the next four hours. So moving to Key West and semi-retiring really gave both Greg, my partner and I, that freedom to sort of explore now our literary aspirations. We put um, the, 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 the weekly paycheck thing aside to a degree, mm -hmm. and we're able to really focus on our creative talent that, that we thought and hoped we had within us. Well, you do. You absolutely do. And your cover is great, by the way. Like Isn't I it? Said, it makes you want to jump back into bed. It really does. Why did you do this to us? It, it <laughs> is. It's, it's great. The, uh, the artistic designer who did this for the publisher, Ann McCain, did a just a beautiful job of getting the the loneliness that mm -hmm. you you do you feel like you if you lay your head on that cool part of the pillow that will be a complete bed mm -hmm, then mm -hmm. sleep perfect. will come finally so finally well it's perfect and we're going to talk all about it we're going to take a quick break right now but we'll be right back after these messages i'm talking with recently published author rodney ross stay with me <laughs> 